we gather to witness and celebrate Alex's commitment to serve with compassion and humility in the footsteps of Christ. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Peace be with you. And with your spirit. We come here to support you, Alex, to pray for you. Grant, we pray, almighty God, that no tempests may disturb us, do not say, I am only a child, for you must go to all to whom I send you and say whatever I command you. With all humility and gentleness, and with patience, support each other in love. I testify that he has been found worthy. We choose this man, our brother, for the order of the diaconate. Beloved brother, Alex, serve the people in love and joy and I was sitting where you are at the moment and I heard those words read by the bishop. The first impulse I had in my whole body was to run down that aisle and get out of here. Realise that God's given you a treasure and the treasure is the people you serve. Do you resolve to conform your way of life always to the example of Christ? Do you promise respect and obedience to me and my successors? I do. Send forth upon him, Lord, we pray, the Holy Spirit. Receive the gospel of Christ, whose herald you have become. So I know some of you have been asking me, Alex, where are you going to be sent? I'm not going anywhere. So. <laughs> <laughs> being ordained as a deacon is not merely a title or position, but sacred calling to serve God and his people. Bow down for the blessing. And a minister of unity and peace in the world. Amen. 